So an epidural steroid injection is in a sense like targeted pain relief for your back pain. So if you're having back pain and it's going down your legs or it's very severe in your back, the epidural steroid injection places medication near the area where the pain is suspected to be generating from and it targets that area and tries to get more focused pain relief in that area. So the textbook answer for how long epidural injections last is about six to eight weeks. That's the goal. Now everyone responds to epidural injections differently. So generally I say the most painful part of the injection is the beginning part when I numb the, numb the back up. And that's really, it's a pinch and a burn and that's because it's the pinch is a needle breaking the skin and then lidocaine entering the skin, that's the response to the anesthetic, it causes a burning sensation, but that wears off in about 30 seconds. And candidates for epidural injections usually are people with back pain that related to a nerve injury or some sort of disc problem in their back. So the goal of the epidural is part of the conservative management. It helps with pain control, but it doesn't necessarily cure the problem in the back. And meaning, so if you have a disc herniation and it's causing pain, an epidural injection is not gonna cause that disc to resolve and go back into place. That part is where physical therapy and exercise and strengthening the back muscles come in. Epidural is mainly to try to get that pain under control so that person can become more active and start doing physical therapy and start getting healthier and living their life.